I'm Kirti Chanda. I'm basically an artist and a curator and I have inaugurated this space called Tasmai in Kurchi Kupam. When a friend of mine, Suresh K. Nair, who is a mural artist from Banaras, wanted to do a show in Pondicherry, I requested him to also do a mural for us here. And he was very obliging. He said, uh, you decide a space, Kirti, and I will do the work. So along with another friend or two, we had a brainstorming session. And I decided that let us do this mural in Kurchikupam to beautify the space in Kurchikupam. So I went around looking at the spaces on the streets around my center. And when I saw this very important junction, which is between Advocate Chinatambi Street and Frosfa Martin Street, I saw that it was one of the most important crossings of Kurchikupam. But very strangely, that corner was being used as an open dump yard and the neighborhood was coming to throw its garbage there. So with this friend from UDC, Devangi, we decided why not do a mural on this wall facing this garbage dump yard so that we can beautify it, add dustbins and tell the people not to dirty it because it was not becoming of that junction. Thus the idea was born. Finally, the work, when it began, uh, it had to be completed in a day because the medium which we selected was a cement relief mural. It is a medium that Suresh, who as a mural artist, has, one can say, kind of evolved this mural as a very quick technique for doing outdoor work when people require an outdoor mural. So the technique is like we plaster the wall like one normally does a plastering but here the plastering has to be one inch thicker sorry one inch thick and once the wall has been plastered it has to on the wet cement be carved out sculpted out and the relief forms have to be done before the cement dries in a couple of hours. Let's say maximum three, four hours it takes for the cement to dry. So this was a technique that Suresh proposed we would use for the mural. And we got down to doing the job. We had two masons, two helpers, about a team of seven, eight artists volunteering to assist Suresh. We started the work in the morning at seven and way into the night till 10 o'clock we were working at it. If I tell about myself, I am a muralist doing experimentations with different spaces both inside and outside the building and the cities. Uh, Benares, I am living in Benares. I am teaching the Benares Hindu University. Uh, 
uh, you know Beraro fit is not very good condition now. Uh, it's an ancient fit. Some people tell me it is very dirty. <laughs> so we thought that to clean the fit and decorate the city. So as a teacher, as a professor in the faculty of visual arts, Benares University, I started doing different mural projects as a public art project for the city. So with the help of our students, we are doing the project. Every year we are doing 10 to 15 big, big space with the different media. This is not only inside, but outside also. So this is going on the project. So our friend Kirti Chandra, you know, told me to do something for Pondicherry. So, so I came here and I got a wall in the government school. Fortunately, it was a five space. So we thought that it is five elements is suitable for this space. So that is the great work of art. <laughs> very intelligently connected the water with the area which had the water tap. There's one area where we had an EB board. So he did a sun and connected the fire where the EB board was. Then he connected the earth where there is a tree growing. So in this way he kind of used the natural elements of the surrounding to match with the natural elements in the mural. I think uh, the drawings are kind of quite rhythmic as is Suresh's style and very linear. It was like, uh, almost like magical to watch him work and the speed at which uh, one after the other the panels were unfolding. I think uh, it is one of the fastest mediums and most direct mediums of uh, mural. Unlike the traditional murals which take over a month to do and which used to be done only indoors. So I'd like to give a little introduction about Suresh. You know, he has studied mural art at Guru Vayu, which is a traditional mural college in Kerala. Having done a BFA, a five years course there, he was uh, interested in studying the modern mural traditions. Then he came to Shantiniketan and did a bachelor's five years course again, followed by a master's, another two years course. Then he went to Philadelphia as a Fulbright scholar to study murals there. And now he's currently teaching at the Banaras Hindu University as a mural assistant professor. So he's, uh, his kind of experience of murals is very vast.
corner of Kuchikupam. The next morning we saw that the municipality workers, who generally have to come and clean up the corner, were kind of up in arms, were not happy about the situation, because firstly it was like showing a finger at them not doing their work properly. Secondly, we had put in very big bins and it made their job rather difficult and they were not happy with that. And they were really, really like unwilling to clean up the corner with the new bins that were there. So I had to kind of goad them, I had to kind of explain to them that see, we are actually making your life easier. Earlier the garbage would have been spread all over the street, now it is in one bin, you have to just empty the bin. Secondly, I tried to explain to them that this was not going to be for always. Slowly we would remove the bins and do a door collection. And thirdly, I told them that if they did their jobs well, people would really appreciate them and they would reward them. So they should actually be happy because we were improving the condition of the neighborhood. So it has been a great community work. It has been a work that was possible only because of the different contributions by the different kinds of people. It could not have been done only with artists or it could not have been done only with environmentalists. It was a good teamwork with the layman, the residents, the school, the municipality, the PWD. And I'd really like to take this occasion to thank everyone who has been part of this project and who has made it possible. A good beginning for Pondicherry. So the young artists take care of the city and do it more projects. It is good for the city, good for the artists, good for the public, good for the society, even good for the government.